it's the day before the wedding. And Calvin's just learned he can't clear out the gift shop he booked for his reception. His plans are falling apart and fast. I feel it's absolutely disastrous. There is no wedding reception, therefore the, the wedding's knackered. Cancelling at such short notice means he has lost almost £3,000 spent on the venue and the caterers that he's already paid for. He has no choice but to head back to his ceremony venue and beg the landowner for help. What's Calvin got me going to my wedding in? There's a car coming. OK. Yes, but it's going to be a bit delayed. OK. A bit delayed? Bye! She could be standing around for hours. And that's not the only place she'll be standing. Coven, have you arranged the seat? Uh, That'll be a no, then. What about that bit of wood? Will that bench fit in there? That wouldn't fit. Scaffold bar or something would do the job. <laughs> That'll do. A plank fit for a princess. <laughs> Meanwhile, 120 miles away. Beginning to get worried now. Just don't like waiting around. As the guests start to arrive at the venue, Leanne's car has only just made it to Aberdeen. Only two hours late. And only a three hour journey ahead. Being pregnant in a wet dress is a bit of a pain in the ass, and I just feel sweaty. This road takes us to, to far and beyond, and it's a hell of a journey to be sitting in a car. Still, at least Leanne's finally en route. And back at the lock, it's getting hairier than Calvin's sporran. I've got a serious problem. I need to get out to the pontoon somehow. What? Why don't you take his boat? Well, well there's a, like, a couple of blow up boat things down there. He's got to move fast as Leanne is getting close. Where are we? Loch Ness. How would he have thought out this, out this way? Knowing that we've got to sit in a car miles and miles and miles. It's a really random place to think of. Well, I see Nessie. Who does he? I bloody do. There's a Nessie down here. Oh, my God, there is a Nessie. Uh, am I actually getting on a Nessie? It's not going to be on Nessie. It oh, is. You're joking. What if it capsizes? I don't like the sea. Well, right now, neither does Calvin. I'm going to go and speak to that speedboat driver because I need to lift out to that pontoon. It's going away. He knew what I was going to ask him. Oh, I just don't want to get my dress wet. Good luck with that. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, don't get me wet. But while Leanne and Jill embark on the last leg of their journey, Calvin is still stranded on the shore. I need to get to that pontoon now to get back to it. Can you get me out there? Oh, my God, there's water coming in the boat. My dress is going to get wet. Can you get me out on that pontoon? We're nearly there, are we? Oh, oh, my God, I'm fucking soaking. Get in there! Oh, speed it off, boys, speed it off. Ah! I don't like this. Oh, my God, I'm fucking soaking. Let's get married! Oh, my God, I'm going to be sick. Oh. Do it again and I'll punch someone in the fucking face. Ah. Let it stay! Just get us here. After an epic three-hour journey by car and one hour by weird monster boat thing, our bride is finally about to see what Calvin's been planning. He's got a paper. Oh, I don't want to cry. <laughs> I can see her. She looks beautiful. 